I want to come on now to discuss option pricing and sensitivity analysis in a geometric Brownian motion process. If you recall, a call option gives the holder of the option the right to acquire stock at a pre-agreed strike price K. It'll exercise this option at time T if the price at time T, X of T, is greater than the strike price K. So the payoff, the value of a European call option at expiration, is the expected value of the maximum of X of T minus K and zero. Let's look at the payoff from a call option for uh, various values of the stock in the range from 50 to 150 for an option with a strike at 100. And we can see that below the strike price, the value of the option is zero. And at 100 and above, the option value increases dollar for dollar with the price of the underlying stock. Earlier on, we showed that we can calculate the expectation of a function of a GBM process. And in this case, the function we're interested in is the call option payoff, the maximum of x of t minus k and zero. When we calculate that expectation, we find this rather complicated expression, which is actually equivalent to the solution of the Black-Scholes differential equation. And we can use it to price a call option with specified values. Here, for example, I'm setting the drift mu to zero, strike price k to 50, initial stock price of 50, the maturity of the option is 0.5, and sigma set to 0.25. Evaluating that option using our option value function, we arrive at the value of 3.52. And we can compare that with the value calculated using the standard Black-Scholes formula using the financial derivative function in the Wolfram language for the same parameters. We can use the option value function, for example, to look at how the value of the option varies as volatility changes, say in the range from 10% to 50%. And when we do that, we see that the option value increases with volatility in a nonlinear way. Option sensitivities, or Greeks as they're known, refer to changes in the value of the option with respect to various of the option pricing formula parameters. So for example, the delta refers to the change in the option value with the underlying stock price. It's the derivative of the option value formula with respect to x. And we can directly calculate that expression as shown here. Let's check the delta for our option with the parameters as before. And here we find that the uh, call option delta is 0.535. The theta of the option is the derivative of the option value with respect to time. And it's a rather more complicated expression as follows. We can apply it to the particular option we've been using with the parameters as before. And we find that the theta is 3.512. And our estimated values are very close to those from the Black-Scholes formula, which we can calculate using the financial derivative function. We can see the delta is equal to 0.535 and the theta is equal to 3.512. And we could go on to compute the other option sensitivities, such as the vega, which is the derivative of the option value with respect to sigma, the volatility, or the gamma, which is the derivative of the delta with respect to the underlying, the rate of change in delta with the stock price.